everybody, and welcome to TCW Fantasy Wrestling. This is Scott here, your host of this program for February 11th, Boston, Massachusetts, and the Garden. We are in the Garden, very famous Garden by uh, Mr. Larry Bird of the Boston Celtics. He made this famous as well as all the other great Celtics. Now we have. Ten matches on the card, two title matches, including your World Tag Team titles. And the World Junior Heavyweight title is on the line. First, we start out with a match between family. It's Alicia Slutcake versus Anne Slutcake in a battle of the Slutcakes. Alicia Slutcake pulls out the victory over Anne as she uses the clover leaf, Alicia Slutcake on somewhat of a winning streak. And just does not like getting her butt kicked by her relative. Or anybody else for that matter, but definitely not by her relative. She is looking for some sort of revenge, but Alicia gets to raise her hand in victory. In the next match, we had Jennifer French miss... A key move, her finisher, the French dip. And Tammy Stevens, who is on a roll so far. Tammy Stevens doing amazing here in TCW Wrestling. Tammy uses the perfect plex, which she has made her own perfection. Tammy Stevens wins the match, beating Jennifer French. In a match where Randy Lee, who gets a title shot next week, at TCW, Lord of the Ladders faces off against Jason Kruger. Randy Lee uses the Randy Lee DDT to win the match. In the next match, we have a five women battle, one fall to a finish. It was Blood Rose, Misty Freeze, Strawberry, Cherry Lollipop, and Rain- Rainbow Light. Strawberry gets the victory as she hits the Strawberry Shake on Rainbow Light and gets the victory in this five-woman craziness. Misty Freeze and Cherry Lollipop are going to have a fight very soon as Misty Freeze and Cherry Lollipop both bled and they fought a lot outside of the ring. In the next match... Diesel Hash and the the Enforcer Steve Anderson. A battle of the Midwest Superstars. Diesel Hash pulls out the victory with a powerbomb on the Enforcer Steve Anderson. The Enforcer is pissed, wants a rematch, and wants a stipulation. We'll find out what the stipulation is very soon here on TCW. The Street Punks get a pinfall victory. Over Credit Line. Credit Line, of course, they had their title shot last month at January Showdown. Street Punks have their shot this uh, this month at TCW Lord of the Ladders. Street Punks pull out a victory. Carrie Williams hidden money for the win. Lady Raven and Kaylee Lewis and Bangle fight in a three-way match. Lady Raven hit the DDT on Bangle. Kaylee Lewis hit the K-Quick on Lady Raven. And Kaylee Lewis wins the match with a pinfall victory over Lady Raven. After the match, someone jumped the crowd and started smacking up Bangle. We did not know who it was until the hood was pulled off. And it was Missa. Missa has made her return to TCW. She did lose that loser leaves TCW match. However, officials have announced Missa will face Bangle at Lord of the Ladders. If Missa wins, she is back with a job. Sunshine and Hellraiser X against Blueberry and Simon Jackson. This was... Not even, a, a, it was a bloodbath. It was an insane match. Sunshine and Blueberry are just two huge 400 pound men. Simon Jackson lost the match with the Sunshine Splash. 
Blueberry hit Sunshine uh, over the head with a chair at the end of it. And then they all started fighting. Simon Jackson came back. I, I don't know how he did because his ribs has got to be encaved. But he jumped Hellraiser X um, outside of the ring. They are going to have a street fight at Lord of the Ladders. Look for that match to be one of the big ones. Big important match. We're coming up at TCW Lord of Ladders. Sunshine and Hellraiser X versus Blueberry Simon Jackson in a street fight. For the World Tag Team Championships. Gene Stanley and Rusty Simmons win the match 21 minutes. That's how long the match took. It was that great of a match. Uh, the college club, frat boy, Nat Lyon, they were having a, a really, really great match. But they couldn't hold their own against the champs. Gene Stanley and Rusty Simmons win and retain with the Doomsday Device. And in the final match, the World Junior Heavyweight Championship on the line, Kabuki Dragon the Champion against Garth Diamond. Garth Diamond, uh, he, he hit the Diamond Dust. Kabuki Dragon rolled out and caught his composure, hit Diamond with a kick. He brought him back into the ring and then locked on the Dragon Sleeper for the submission victory. Kabuki Dragon wins, retains his title, and moves on to TCW Lord of Ladders. I want to thank you guys so very much for hanging out with us here at TCW Fantasy Wrestling. Look for... Thursday the 15th we'll have another show, big time show, and then of course the 18th, TCW, Lord of the Ladders. (laughs) 